afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Today is 24th of September 2021. And in this uh, video, I would like to present you three excellent firms, IT firms in Subotica, Serbia. Uh, tonight was the, the researchers night in Subotica in several locations. There were some lectures and presentations and uh, I went to this one location only and uh, I spent a very, very pleasant time uh, speaking with the CEOs of the firms or some of the marketing managers you will see in the video. I was very happy that I come to this place. In the beginning of uh, the video you will uh, see the camera uh, recording uh, from the motorcycle I rode to the place. So you, if in case you come to Subotica, you will be able to see how to come to this place, to this IT hub. And then uh, we will see the surroundings a little bit from the entrance of the, this new building, which is built two years ago. And then later on, you will see the whole interior of the building and the presentation of each firm. Uh, they are young, young people, very much evolving and very much dedicated. Successful, three successful firms, which are uh, expanding every year. So I was very happy that I spent these several hours of tonight in this uh, IT hub. And I hope that you will get a, an interesting information, a useful information, either if it is a, a youth in Serbia or abroad, Hungary or other country, you will hear the firms and the, what they are producing, what on which kind of projects they are working, how they are functioning. And of course, I will put all the, all the data I will put in the description of the video about the name of the firm, the contact uh, details, how you can contact them. So it was a very fruitful, very fruitful evening and time. I hope that you will enjoy. Uh, of course, my uh, recording is not uh, professional. Maybe somewhere the camera is too low or I did not catch the face properly. Please forgive me for that. I could not uh, place my, my attention all the time. I didn't put it on tripod. So there might be some, some mistakes or maybe some audio disturbance. Somewhere it's a little bit more loud, some background music or something. But uh, mainly the whole topic is very interesting and, and, uh, and uh, the people who presented them, they very beautifully presented the firm and the uh, <coughs> work process and how they are functioning. Please enjoy it. and girls here we are here we are at the IT hub so what it's up at Sumborska 33A you will see what's going on it's a new building this is also a building belonging to this building there will be a spa, spa center the workers told me this is a smart building
Here we are. Noć istraživača. The researcher's night. Ovo zelen naukom. With the green sciences. Aha, these are the places where the thing will go. Some gaming corner, some food and refreshment. You know what? The weather. Ovo je kao društvena prostorija za za zgradu. Aha. Znači tu ovdje se održavaju sastavci. Da, 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 da. Hvala lijepo. E, dobar dan. Poštovanje. Super. Da, da, da. Već me ufat, evo, i počne da mi kaže o dva placa koje se su uzeli. Ja malo snimam. Ups. Ovim proces. Ovdje iza se nalazi jezero sa protočnom vodom. Little lake with some flowing water. I suština te vode je da ljudi čuju. Tu sede puno ljudi kada su na sastanci imali rada nešto. Da čuju žugo vode. I tu ispred su dve terase. Nažal da sad ništa nije reprezentativno. To tu se rado i već sledeće godine će sve biti gotovo. It's not yet done. They are planning some water. Full kind of, yes, of course, uh, to make the people feeling better and more relaxed. But it's not actually very nice, but it's uh, in process of building. There will be a lake and continue actually, to build. Actually, there is already a lake. It was all working so far, but we put it down because we are in the middle of the process of building next door. So Super. Currently it's closed. Uh, somebody told me that uh, the building is existing few years and it's growing and growing in just yeah. just few years. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Several companies, yeah, 80 three, people. Three companies, more than 80 people currently and we are expanding. Uh, the, uh, actually, this is the smart building. I, I don't know, do you know that fact, actually? Uh, I, I, I heard about uh, the phrase of smart building. It means that the temperature can be yeah, yeah, automatically okay. entrance, yeah. entering, yeah. checking everything from mobile phone. Yeah, yeah. You can check even the walls. There is no any switches. So uh -huh. This is the... Um, let me check. Can I open it for you? Okay. At the moment... Uh, so you can... Uh, you can choose who who can enter, who who can't enter. Yeah, yeah. Who cannot, who can? They have the cards. Card passes. The mobile, mobile phone just to enter. Uh -huh. It has the app uh, on the mobile phone, etc. Through so through QR codes or or okay, different we have, we have different system. Full uh, developed app. This okay. is our in-house system. This is for the Serbian, completely Serbian. Uh, app for smart buildings. Okay. Ah, so, so the, 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 so, the software, software is built here. Yeah, yeah, it's built. I here. see. And I you see. You can control everything almost from um, lights to temperatures, heating, to um, gates. Uh, also, you can control the hallway, the garden, everything. I see. So I basically, see. it's different based on different kind of users. This user here can control only this, and some other users can control the entire building. Let me show okay, you. Okay. So this is our little kids' corner. Yeah, kids' corner. We <laughs> really love it because we are proud of this, uh, these pictures because it's really made by the children from our dads and, and men. You know that we are working here. So I see. Proud corner. You know? Okay. Игра пинг-понг. Не мое играние. I suggest you to go downstairs and I'll show you mine. 
Oh, ah, okay, okay. And then you should go downstairs and also check. Okay. So this building also has a name. Uh, it is a digital hive. It means young people that are clever like bees and working like bees. And this is the logo of the building. I see. Okay. Yes. And uh, this is also one of the IT companies. And just, just a small peek, this is very, very close. Uh, basically, okay. this, well, this is the opening canal to survive the Jalas Vesta Jalas name. Takwe. Takwe. He owns a YouTube canal. He owns a Ugla Nomi na Englesko. Jer želim da bude otvoren široj publici, da? Pa će nešto biti sapajdlovano na srpski, jer neki baš ne razumeju ni engleski. Ok, so basically, this is the heart of this smart home system. Aha. These are the controllers. Ok. Server. So this, this is the, the controllers, the testing room, where we are testing how the smart building solution is working. This is just one of the rooms. So basically we use the hardware and the software here in server. You know, we just get the parts from China, etc. But everything is produced here. Okay? Okay. Uh, you can come back and just shoot, but let me show you the, the, my agency. Okay. Or the studio present agency. Studio present. Okay. This is just one of one of three mm -hmm. IT companies. Yeah. So Studio present. Once you enter here, you can see that we have like like living room space. You know, okay. like you are at the home. Everybody has their own. I see. I see, I see, I see, yeah, I see. So everybody can... No shoes. Yeah, no shoes. Very good. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Beautiful, no beautiful. No I, would, shoes, I could take off my shoes, it's no problem yeah, for me. Yeah, no, 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 no. <laughs> okay, this is our wall, basically, what we are doing. So, you know, we're spending... <laughs> 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 Ping pong. You all have a <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, no problem. So basically, this is our wall of memories, let's call it like that. You know, we spend a lot of time together, we go to team buildings, etc. Et yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, so how, how long is your company existing? Uh, since 2009. I see. Uh, this is just our movement place, like the new building in the It uh, started in Subotica? Or? Yeah, it started. Yeah, fully started. So, I see. So to show you also that all, all the plants here are completely real. So no, no this synthetic. Is olive, this is a leaf tree. I see. I see, I see. And, and you can go on. Maybe in that direction. So these are the work, pla work uh, places of the of the company people. Yeah. So we have the open space in this in this particular uh, place. We have the open area, so everything is open and everybody could communicate with each other. But we wanted to have the real presence to uh, to uh, hold uh, too much noise and to reduce the noise, you know, and to make feel the people feel that. Okay. Everybody are organized in teams. So I see. That means that, for, for example, backends, developer teams are uh, at the same place. Marketing team is at the same place. So everybody could communicate. On the next floor, we will have much more uh, like offices. So the team could go and, and speak together. This is the next uh, next stage of the development. Which, which is uh, building now? Yeah, yeah, which is actually finishing in the finishing process. Okay, okay. As you can see, the, the light is automatic as soon as we came in. I see. The, lights, the light turned on. Uh, basically, this is the small meeting room, like for the for the first meetings and for for the talks between teams and maybe some Skype meeting with the video, uh, with the external team or clients. Those people are your clients who yeah. order the. Yeah. I see. And silent. 
quite uh, quite good is isolation this is like for the talks ah, yeah. that, that's the small one this is the place where I speak because I'm too loud I'm speaking over <laughs> Uh, enjoy, you can go to the next video. Okay. You can also explore this tablet that I just put it down because we just put uh, this tablet and there is also an um, application for the smart building which is different than downstairs because it's adjusted for our office. So I see. Check it. Thank you very much. Yeah, enjoy. Thanks. Hello. 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 So very good. Here is the main controller center. Airsoft. This is another company. But is this some kind of e cookies? Separate room for meetings. Beautiful. Projectek in Hungary. A <laughs> natural <there. laughs> Okay. <laughs> You're there. So here, this is a, another company. Uh, I'm making a video in English. <laughs> for YouTube, my YouTube channel. I would like to inform the Subodica population about this. New building and new oops, ah, why is so much zoom? Nem baj, hogy angolul. Uh, mikor, mióta létezik ez a firma, a Digest? Uh, tehát az Ercoft 2011 Ercoft. óta. 2011. 11 óta, és a From 2011. társalapítók vagyunk a Digital Hive-ban. Cég, illetve az az entitás, ami az épület mögött. Felvehetem? Ahogy mondtam? Jó. Tehát alapjában még a három cég egyike vagyunk, az alapító cégek egyike vagyunk. One of the three companies. We are one of the three companies that uh, created this uh, office building. This is a state of the art, at least in this region I find this is a kind of a state of the art uh, building with its uh, smart office features. Um, we are living here since two years. We settled in in August 2019. I see. Uh, we had a year celebration to settling in the building. Uh, it was built for three years or two two years, two and a half years approximately. Okay. Uh, once we moved in, uh, basically all three company found its its great home here. We have great common areas uh, where we enjoy spending time. Currently, uh, the second floor is under construction because of that. Uh, some of the the common areas like the like the chill part or the chill terrace at the back of the building is, is, is not in function. The lake and the water the, fountain. The, uh, yeah, yeah, we had kind of a, of, a, of a small fountain with a nice uh, chill lake or zen lake as we I like see, to call I it. see. Uh, that is currently not in use. However, we expect that next year we will be able to use that. Excellent. Excellent. What have I missed? Uh, that the, the, that company said that they are existing from 2009. Well, you are also existing from approximately two or well, different well, starting point. We started in 2011 officially. Ah, okay. So two, two, three years later. Well, two years later, basically we are in the business since 2006 in various forms. Officially, Airsoft was founded in 2011. Um, here in Subotica. Here in Subotica, of course. Yeah, we started okay. as a garage company. Like it? Like a garage company. I see. So I see. Like Apple, Windows, uh -huh. or Microsoft. Ah, okay, okay. And, and From some device. small seed form. Exactly, exactly. For a children's room, we managed to, to get here. Currently, we have 25, 21 employees working okay. in this office only. Okay. So this is only Airsoft I'm talking about. Uh, we are mainly focusing on, on web development, some application development. I see. Including, uh, when you say web, web de development, you mean websites? 
Websites are, are one aspect of our portfolio. Uh, lately, we've been strongly moving towards ERP systems and more complex systems. So not just only webshops and e-commerce solutions, but only solutions they are more more in depth of of, of, a, of a business logic. I see. I see. Okay. <laughs> Excellent. Uh, and uh, how how the clients how they find you on internet of course but uh, well, yes our internet presence is, is, is quite quite strong however uh, the the power of the of the of the, of the clients so uh, it's going mouth by mouth to I see. be honest I see uh, lately we've been seeing a lot of new clients coming in from already existing clients of ours I see so the network so, is, is getting bigger and bigger day by day and we always find new challenges for ourselves through these new projects I mean uh, the, this, the existence of this building it shows that uh, the whole thing is developing. Absolutely, absolutely. So that's a great sign. Well, we have the College of Applied Sciences here in Subotica that is producing a lot of new material or a lot of new colleagues for us. If you look around, almost all of our, our colleagues currently uh, employed here were or are currently uh, students of the, of the college here in Subotica. Uh -huh. And we are expecting that Subotica is going to be one of the, of the biggest hotspots of, 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 of IT solutions or IT centers in, in Serbia. Very good. And hopefully in the whole region. Very good, very good. We have huge competition here. Seged is nearby. I see. A huge, huge. Uh, uh, um, are they good? What spot? Well, indeed, they, they have to be good if, if they are so strong with IT. I see. And, and also they have the advantage that, that they are already in the European Union. I see. However, I think we are getting stronger and stronger day by day. Okay. Uh, in our country, I would say Belgrade, Novi Sad, and hopefully Sobotica is the third position. And uh, I'm, I'm really looking forward for the upcoming period, since it's going to be really interesting in terms of IT here. Not only because of the initiatives we have currently, so Sobotica 2030 initiative, but uh, everybody is striving towards the goal to have huge IT centers here in Sobotica. Okay. Uh, how do you feel? I mean, they have the advantage of European Union, but uh, are the youngsters here in Serbia more creative than, let's say, Hungary? How you would, how you would judge that point concerning IT sector Great and creativity? Okay. Uh, well. I don't think they lack of creative minds, but neither do we. Okay. So, uh, to be honest, I don't think it would be, be fair to compare. However, I think we are on a really great path uh, and we have a lot of potentials in our younger generations since I think I already, with, with 16 years of experience, can say that I'm not okay. of, the, of the younger generation or the youngest generation here. Uh, I think we have huge potential in them, and I really see new leadership growing here, right now. Maybe, maybe I mean, in Serbia, I, I heard that there are many young people who work for uh, very strong companies from home. Yeah. They produce softwares and they really work for top companies, so they are very strong-minded and, and uh, very creative youngsters. Maybe we don't, we, we don't hear about them, but still they are here working from Serbia and they are not lacking creativity in no, competition with other great minds in America or anywhere. No, neither creat creativity nor, nor, nor knowledge that we lack. Uh, and yeah, a lot of the talents are, are hidden. And especially now we see during this pandemic period of, of time that uh, working from home office, for, freelancing from home office is, is, a, is a working thing. Uh, we know that it's not for everyone because it's not working for everyone. But especially with, with, uh, with IT centers like ours here, I think we can show that we also have the qualities of the huge 
company. So you have fantastic working environment, you have great company here, uh, in terms of colleagues of course I mean, and also in terms of uh, companies they decide to build something new here. Uh, so I think uh, it doesn't really matter whether one, one finds oneself uh, working for a huge international company or a local one, the chances, the possibilities and the, and the, and the challenge to, to make something great is always there. Okay. Uh, what kind of uh, inspiring points you could raise uh, working with you in this company for someone who is uh, targeting such kind of job? For example, staying in Subotica and if he's looking for opportunities, uh, which kind of points you would raise that this and this and this is something special? I don't know, for example, the salary or the possibility for advancement or the equipment on which he would work? Which kind of points you would raise? Almost you mentioned all the, all the great selling points. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I would have normally said. Uh, well, first of all, uh, we really appreciate our colleagues and we think uh, those colleagues who are sitting here and filling these 20-something positions here are really one of the best currently in the, in the, in the current scene that we can uh, get. Uh, okay. But this is not, not, a, not by chance so. We are working actively on that. That all our colleagues, first of all, they have a great working environment. They have a friendly, um, a friendly uh, click with that they can work and in work in terms that they can really enjoy what they are working since we find one can only be creative and productive when one is really working in an environment that well, one, where one feels oneself at home so uh, that is one key aspect that we cherish and, and, and aim to, to achieve each and every day the other thing is as you mentioned the technology technology in terms uh, what they know, what they use day, day to day. Uh, we strive to, to, to implement the, the latest technologies for our clients. Can you, can you please uh, tell us a few examples of technical characteristics of the computers they use? Uh, like mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, of course. processing uh, power? Well, th that would be the other selling point that we have great uh, uh, hardware. Uh, mainly we have, let me check, mainly we have Lenovo um, uh, notebooks here. Okay. We all work on notebooks. Okay. We find... Portability is important. Yeah, mobility is, is important, whether we are speaking that we, we need to attend a meeting or we would like to use our, our standing desk there or the chill area. Usually our colleagues use those facilities as well to work. Uh, so mainly we are Lenovo based, we are using Lenovo based technologies Okay. All, almost all i7 core processors. Okay. So we do not have the, the processing capability. Okay. Uh, we are using almost all of our, uh, our, our displays are 27 inches 4K displays. So I think... Graphic, graphic cards? Graphic cards. RTX or, or not, not yet? Mm -hmm. Well, uh, NVIDIA, I'm cheating to be honest right now, I try to pick on our computers. Okay. To be honest, at some point when you have a computer that just runs as you wish, then you don't really care about what kind of hardware runs okay. underneath it, as long as it grows smoothly. Okay. So, to be honest, okay. I think we are using a mixed combination of, of NVIDIA's and, and uh, Ati cards. Okay. Uh, all of them are integrated however dedicated within the, the, the computer. Um, and the goal is not, uh, not to play the most recent games on this computer, so no, the tasks are, no, no, tasks, no. tasks for, for are different. Our, for, our, for our job, uh, uh, graphic cards are not that important. Okay. Uh, for, for our graphic designer, of course, yes it is. Okay. And for, for most of the front-end developers, it might also be handy to be able to use Photoshop and, and such um, graphic-oriented programs smoothly. Otherwise, the colleagues, they, they are spending their, their almost whole day uh, coding, so oh, the back-end developers. I for see. them, graphic card is, is not I that see. important. Okay. 
Okay, very good. Can you show me, for example, this this part yes, is uh, a working okay. working desks? Let's yeah, see. These are our working stations. Uh, a typical working station. Let me show you this one. Okay. Okay. So. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, what, what is your name and position in the in the firm? I'm Robert Dudash. I'm a business analyst okay. at Microsoft. Okay. Um, and what was the other question? Uh, business. Yes, yes. Yes. Business analyst. Okay. And co-owner, in fact. Yes. Okay. Okay. So basically, let's say this is a, a, a core example of our working stations. Let me remove this That's paper off. from here. Um, so this is a, a 27 inch 4K display of yes. Lenovo along with a 17 inch um, it is a gamer notebook I'm sure however GeForce uh, yeah with GeForce graphics i7 processor yes. well I can't complain it's it's running smoothly with okay. SSD integrated of course uh, 16 gigs of RAM I see okay this, this is kind of the standard here very uh, good, I see. For colleagues, they need less power, more mobility. I see. Smaller. For a little bit smaller. Laptop. Uh, laptop, computer. This is a Radeon one with Ryzen 5 processor. Uh, are the re the reason, reasons are the most the newest? Um, most probably. The laptops are not older than a year and a half. I see. I see, I see, I see. And I think we would be in trouble to find anything older than, than, I see. than, than three years here. I, 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 I uh, tell you honestly, I don't know much about uh, technology. I just heard, uh, because I live on YouTube lo watching lots of uh, videos, mm -hmm. and uh, have some friends uh, who is working uh, like, a, like a system administrator in, uh, mm -hmm. in uh, one of the firms in Bimok. He told me that the IMD has uh, grown so much, so suddenly with these uh, processors, that the Intel, which was all the time the top number one, is now lacking space, like maybe behind one year. Concerning uh, internet security, what you could say about that point? Well, internet security is really important. <laughs> it doesn't really matter if one is, is, is a, a home user or a professional user like us. Um, we have a, a separate or, or a dedicated server room here in this building. Okay. We also host some of our solutions uh, as well as our neighbors do. Uh, we put huge emphasis on, on, on system security for that. That, that is a whole, whole another uh, perspective of, 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 of uh, IT expertise. I see. To be honest, I, I'm not an IT expert in, in that field. Uh, pretty so the, build, the, build, the building has a separate group of people? We can say, or yeah, we can say that because all three company has their own professionals. They 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 take care of the of the servers we have on site. We also have servers in other locations around the globe to serve our clients. I see. Uh, it is a rather complex uh, task to be up to date and really on the top of the of the current uh, security uh, situation. Um, <laughs> to, to be honest, in details, I couldn't really uh, tell more. Uh, okay. Um, uh, you, uh, so your company is based in Subotica? Exactly. Do you have, you work closely with some companies, some other country? Uh, yeah, mainly our clientele is international. Okay. Uh, mainly we work with Hungarian companies. We I have see. a lot of clients locally in terms of Subotica, but as well within the boundaries of the country. Uh, but we also have clients in Austria, uh, Germany, the United Kingdom, USA. Uh, Statistically, from which country more or most? Hungary for most. Okay. That, okay. that is for sure. It, <coughs> it, does it help that it, it's close physically? Indeed, yes. 
and so, so from, speaking, from some aspect, yes, it helps. Well, we are speaking the same language. I see. Okay. That helps a lot okay. in terms of, of, of communication. Okay. Nevertheless, uh, we, we, we find that uh, language is not a barrier at all for us. Since all our colleagues speak at least English, some as of we can see from <laughs> this example, <laughs> we speak a little bit of English. Uh, some of us speak some other languages. I personally have uh, German-speaking clients, a lot of English-speaking clients. Um, that makes the whole whole process a little bit more interesting, if I may say. Of uh, course. I, I wouldn't say that it's, it is not, not great to work with, with Hungarian or local Serbian companies. Nevertheless, seeing uh, other business cultures is also an important part of, of, of personal growth and company growth. And because they are in European Union, they have more flow. It means that uh, final, from financial aspects, and tasks, they have more, most probably, opportunities, kind of, yes, more flow. You know, uh, gladly we have great opportunities here in Serbia as well. Okay. Uh, okay. A lot of, of European funds are, are financing a lot of, of projects within the Western Balkan region that we belong to. Okay. Um, therefore, we, we can't really say that, that there are not enough opportunities here. for companies here. Okay. They are actively uh, helping our clients, not in, just in terms of, of, of IT aspects. However, we, we usually tend to reach out to them if we find some business opportunity to be arising uh, in terms of, 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 uh, of uh, foreign funds uh, where they can tap on and, and find business uh, opportunities for themselves. I see. Therefore, we find that a, a few, uh, 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 it is more a synergy or more, more a, uh, being a partner than just being a client and, uh, and a developer. I see, I see, very nice. Uh, and I think this, this is quite fruitful cooperation that we have uh, both with companies within Subotica as well as, as around the region. I see. Each company, each of these three companies, they have a, a director or they have a board? Uh, these are three different companies, okay. three separate companies with okay. their uh, uh, directors and, and, and owners. Uh -huh. uh, the common thing between us three is the existence of this building. Okay. That we decided a couple of years ago to join forces okay. and and uh, establish something new and, and exciting. So that's the only thing which is connecting you. Otherwise, you are fighting all the time. No, okay, no, no, no. And <laughs> one would, competition. One would, it's one competition. One would think. One would think since we uh, we are working in the same. Uh, business area or branch. Nevertheless, we almost never had an issue with this that we found also quite interesting at the beginning. Okay. Of course, when one decides to 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 establish uh, uh, as office building together with two other companies, they are sharing the same the the, the same field or or the the same the same sea of clients. Nevertheless. Uh, this far, and I, I'm pretty sure it, this won't come up in the future <laughs> either, uh, either that, that we will have problem with this. Excellent. So, so uh, Very nice. it, it is more a nice cooperation. And maybe this even got us closer together. We have um, projects running that we deliver together. Uh -huh. And, oh, and there good. are tasks we, 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 where we reach out to each other. Uh, to deliver uh, a fully fledged uh, project. Excellent. What is the top speed of the internet in the building? Um, On that 50 megabit per sec, or <laughs> we, uh, we have a gigabit uh, a connection. Gigabit connection. Gigabit connection that we deal or, or share. That is uh, through satellite or uh, satellite. Through satellite, not not line, no line uh, connection. Optical, optical, ah, optical. Direct, direct optical connection. I, uh, 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 I see. So direct connection. Uh, I can't complain. It's a symmetric uh, uplink. Okay. So both upload and download is the same speed. Oh. So we don't have issues with with. Not much legs. <laughs> no legs, not at all. 
Um, Square pictures. <laughs> no, nothing like that. I see. I guess and, I and we are really glad about that. Twenty-first century. Uh, just interesting. I, I don't think there can be an IT company that ha doesn't have a really good internet connection in twenty twenty-one. Yes, it's naturally it, the and basis. Absolutely. Even to start to think about it. Well, look, at the beginning, everyone starts with a home internet connection. You know, at some point, you always start with that. The question is how much you can do to, to have something where, where you don't have to think about that there is an internet connection. It is just normal. I see. I see. So everything goes smoothly. Thank you very much. You are most certainly welcome. Thanks. Igen, igen, igen. A kanál is volt angolul. Angolul nyomom, hogy nyitott legyek. Super. So this is our meeting room. This is currently a smaller meeting room that can facilitate eight people at a time. Uh, we have a huge team on the wall to have presentations. Uh, first we thought about having projectors. However, projector does not give back the same experience that you have with a display. I see. This is why we have uh, set up this, this configuration here. Uh, this is the place where we have our daily meetings. I see. As well as with the clients. On the screen we have our team building that we were on this year. This was in July where we went to Bosnia and Herzegovina to, to rafting. Oh, oh uh, I see. We have a, a nice common experience. It is always and to, to relax a little bit. To relax, absolutely, absolutely. So you... It was a three day trip. Uh, we went with a, with a huge bus, so we had time to relax together. Uh, the rafting was a really nice experience. We all were, all were looking towards that, and it was really a, a, an experience of a lifetime. This is a working day. Uh, this is a working day. This is a couple of days ago when we captured this uh, this time lapse. This is from the other side of the of the office. Uh, yeah, so a it, short one. So it it is uh, clear that. Uh, as you respect uh, the work, <coughs> you respect the other part, the rest, the resting of the people, that they can gather, gather some energy to, to be able to continue with the same power and, and creativity to work. The company is just as strong as their uh, colleagues and workers. We all know that and I don't think that there is any successful company that neglects its, its, its workers. We found, find that uh, we have a collective rather than a working branch. So this is why we put emphasis on, on free time activities. We, we spend a lot of time together and not just the eight hours that we have to spend here working. during our working hours. Okay. So we have separate teams. We are participating on, on running events. We are doing OCR uh, tracks. Um, we are playing volleyball weekly. We also have a, a board game. Where was this? This was in, in Bosnia. Pocha, Bosnia. Wow, so clear water. Absolutely, it's drinkable water. And yet we decided for beer. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> so, this is basically our, our, our meeting room. Okay. Um, <laughs> that was good. This is the developer deck, the common space area or open space area. This is almost where almost all our developers work uh, on their working stations. Okay. Or if they wish to work uh, spending them, these desks, this desk is, is a, 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 a great place okay. to work from. Uh, and lately, I see a lot of colleagues using our chill area where currently uh, knowledge is power, game is going on. Who uh, played that? Uh, is it quiz kind of? Yeah, yeah, yes, it is. Since it is researchers now, we decided to go with uh, Put up some quiz. Okay. I see. Uh, it is a PlayStation game where everyone using their smartphones can tap the 
correct answer or the answer they think Bluetooth that, connection or Wi-Fi connection? Uh, Wi-Fi connected. Okay. So uh, each each film is connected to the PlayStation itself. Using an application, they see all the possible answers on their display. And they have to tap on the on the correct answer. They have some kind of additional features to make others' life a little bit more complicated. <laughs> <laughs> so it is it's really a fun to. It's not not only to advance for yourself, but to make it more you hard. Disadvantage for the others, yes. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Why would be easier for him to advance Absolutely. if it can be more difficult? <laughs> I see. Okay. So uh, are they? This is wine, real wine? Uh, those are real wines we, we got from our clients. Yes, oh, that's I, it. See. I see. I see. And just to have a hand something. <laughs> okay. Yes, uh, please. Go ahead. This is the hall room. Yes, so. This is for seeing for two people to use at the time. I see. Uh, with additional displays. This is mainly used for smaller conversation, phone calls. Uh, some, 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 something like that. I'm joking with it. Okay. And usually, if we are speaking with clients, we, we get in with our laptops. We can hook on on this this displays. Uh, this is why we have our logo on the wall. So if I we are see. speaking, our clients can see the, the logo as well. Yeah, that logo I is diff is diff No, it's the, the same. It is the same. It I is see. the same. Airsoft. Airsoft. Exactly. Um, From a. Uh, from which kind of word came the earth soft? What's the meaning? What is the, which earth soft? Earth, what is earth? The initial owners or, or founders' uh, last name is Erdudat. Ah, uh -huh, I see. Earth soft, I see. And the soft is, is, is pretty easy to guess. Okay. Uh, yes. So this is the, the rest of the uh, open space area. Um, these are some moments of our lives. Uh, a short presentation with, with with captured moments we have. Are you looking for some specialists presently? We are always looking for specialists. I see. Shall I list? Yeah, uh, yeah, a few, few. Yes, why not? Uh, mainly we are looking for PHP developers. Uh, Symphony Framework is an especially interesting segment. We are looking for Vue.js developers. Node.js developers, uh, .NET developers, C, okay. C Sharp, C plus. Ah, uh, these are the languages. Uh, this was the whole from the whole list. This I understood partially. <laughs> okay, well, at least that. Okay. Uh, and finally, we have a small kitchen here. Aha. Uh -huh. uh, this is my place. <laughs> well, we have the common kitchen downstairs. I see. With a huge dining area. I see. Uh, where we all have. Our, our separate fridges and so on and so forth. However, we find it is quite interesting to... <laughs> wow, to it's not empty. It Ex is not as you, empty. As you can uh, see, it's uh, not empty. We, we, we have uh, soft drinks available for our colleagues. Uh, as you can see, we have a, tab a table there where you can just put... Ah, I see, I see. You take something and I see, I see, I see. Month we, we the, God, the God will play. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Exactly. You just take and somebody will take it. <laughs> well, something like that. Something like that. So uh, basically, that, that this is our, our, our little mm. home. Okay. Uh, what I really love. Well, security in first place, of course. Um, what I really like, uh, and, and I would like to, to emphasize, our artworks. Okay. Uh, I don't know if you heard about Emma Pesti. Emma Pesti? Emma Pesti, an upcoming uh, uh, artist from Subotica. Hmm. Uh, he has, in my opinion, a really unique kind of approach to, to art. Okay. And in a full production or a cooperation. Uh, but these are not, not, not hers. All the, all the paintings in art. Office are, are from Emma Pesti. I see. Oh, yeah, okay. So all of these that you see on the wall are from Emma. I think that is one particularly interesting. Beautiful. I see. The blue wave, kind of. I see. Uh, the working hours are uh, flexible. 
I see, okay, so yes. We are working in a, in a flexible working hour approach. Okay. However, we are have a time frame where we expect all our colleagues to be available for work. Okay. Uh, we prefer to have all our colleagues here, and not because we want to control them, but we think that Together, working in an atmosphere. To, working together, atmosphere. Yeah, the working atmosphere is, is important, and, and working together is, is important. the key expect here. Because if something uh, raising some question, then he can uh, ask, so not always through the phone. And exactly, it is easier to reach out our, our, to our other colleagues, but also the, the atmosphere is is pretty special here. I have to say. Very nice. Very nice. Hi, uh, this is uh, welcome to Dive Deep Inside Channel. We are here in this uh, new building. I got a, a little close-up info about the two firms on the top floor, and uh, we have seen the dining hall. And I have not been in this uh, part of the of the building. Can you please tell me your your name, your position in the firm, uh, your firm name, the name? And a uh, little bit about uh, about your firm. So, welcome. My name is Alexander Kovic. I'm the CEO of ICB Tech. So, our company is ICB Tech. Okay. So, uh, we do a lot of things which are, uh, let's say, smart solutions. We do IoT and we do. Uh, Mobile apps, mobile platforms. So the, the so softwares for the smart houses, software, buildings. Well, we do. We, do uh, we are oriented towards mobile devices, handheld devices. So we make hardware solutions for those. We make software for those. Okay. okay. Yeah, and we make custom solutions for various kinds of uh, projects and various kind of uses. We had industrial type of projects. We had professional use projects like. Two guide systems, audio guide systems. Uh, we do a lot of uh, mobile apps for various purposes, okay. web projects, and we also have very complex projects which involve a lot of new technologies like data science, machine learning. So we, we cover a lot of ground. We have various specialties. What what year what year did you start your company? We started in 2011. Okay. So we were soon in about two months in our 10th anniversary. Oh, very nice. And I, I heard that the building is built uh, two years ago. That's then that's all, all the three companies moved in. Yes. Like two years ago. So it was a joint project. The three yeah. companies came together. We said we want a modern, nice building as our headquarters. I see. We came up with this. So all the, all the three CEOs are like friends, or you you know each other from before? We know we know each other from before, but you know we became even more close during the the project and the the, the creation of the of the firm. Of this joint project here. How many workers do you have in your company? Currently, we have uh, 28 people in full time employed, uh -huh. and we have a number of people in uh, Just once. 28 workers, so it seems to me that uh, this company is the, at the moment the biggest because they have like 22, I guess, uh, what I heard from the. From the Yes, and soft? Uh, I think we are somewhere like studio present. I see. And maybe they have a couple of people more. More, I see. I they, they are currently the biggest company here in the building, but we are close. I see. Uh, I, I have never been here. Today I came in the afternoon to see where the building is, that I don't lose time for searching. And uh, it's very nice and it's smart. I heard about smart uh, buildings before. My friend, one of my friends, he created a house, a house, a flat. He wanted to make it smart, and he told me that he wants to control it from his mobile phone, the temperature, the lights, that he can switch it on off before he comes home. That that's the kind of one kind of the advantage of smart home or flat or whatever building that you can uh, you can. Uh, give commands through mobile phone from far. You don't need to be present and you can 
adjust the temperature you want. That's you right. And most probably hundreds of different stuff, the lights or switch on the cooker or whatever, the microwave or, or whatever, some computer, you need to upload some big file and you don't want to do it in this time, so most probably you can do it. Uh, yeah. So one of the main advantages is that you can uh, do all things remotely, so you okay. can use an app to switch on, switch off different things. You can also schedule different things to be turned on at certain times. There is a number of uh, sensors which can be used to achieve different triggers or actions, such as so you set a temperature sensor that at certain temperature you should turn on the uh, uh, ventilation or uh, the cooling system or, or turn on the heating if it's cold. So that's, th those are some of the advantages that you can use a smart system. You told me uh, hardware also. It means uh, the, the, the things, the mechanical things uh, concerning the smart house that you are building, some of that also, not only the software part. We build hardware, yes. The hardware that we build is something that you can describe uh, most closely as a mobile phone type of devices. So they are hand handheld devices, so that's our specialty. I see, I see. And uh, those kinds of uh, devices include various electronic parts, various sensors, displays, things like that. So in those devices we don't have a lot of mechanical things. Oh, okay, for, okay. For smart houses, typical mechanical things are well, maybe relay switches, but they are also now well, switched or they are less popular because they are clicking. So I they see. tend to be replaced with solid state uh, relays or something like that, which don't make any noises. Okay. Uh, so, for example, so when you have a, a, a magnet at the door to open it or close it, so that's one mechanical part. Um, yeah, I would say that. Typically, there is not so much uh, okay. mechanical parts. I see. It's more, it's more uh, common in industrial applications where you have machines, big machines, and things like that. They, there, you have more mechanical parts. I see. Do you use uh, solar panels in in this building? We don't have yet solar panels, but okay. we're actually planning to work on it. To incorporate yes, some. And to have them because we also think about. Uh, Ecology and green. I, I have seen that on the on the poster. Uh, can can you please tell me a few aspects of the companies which are placed in this building? On what plan are you working on for envir environmental cleanliness? So which which aspects of the company is trying to to do something about environment betterment of the environment? So, uh, in which way you you. Well, I think we mentioned a couple of topics which also have uh, green and ecological aspects as well. Because, for example, when we talk about smart buildings, then it's important to preserve energy. So that's uh -huh. an important okay. green aspect. And with uh, good software and uh, good scheduling, you can preserve a lot of energy. So that's one big thing. Okay. Uh, also, we do uh, chargers for electrical vehicles. That's one of our projects. Mm. Uh, that's also one big concept now toward the uh, well, less pollution because of the fossil fuels and uh, vehicles using gas and diesel. So, uh, um, various kinds of energy management are also uh, um, well, ecological aspects. For example, uh, how much power does it use, how much power do you need to use to charge your vehicle, when, uh, when is the uh, uh, electricity price uh, lower or higher, when it is cheaper to, you know, to, charge, it. to charge your car or, or to turn on, I don't know, a bigger consumer of electrical uh, current in your, in your uh, house, such, a, such as a washing machine or something like that. So those are kinds of things that we work on and we have those projects. But for our own building, uh, where we are, uh, we are thinking about preserving uh, the power when we don't need to, uh, you know, not to use not necessary power. And also we want to put, it, put on solar panels on the top of the roof, so we can also uh, produce enough or 
for your uh, needs and needs, yeah, I see. So we can lower the uh, consumption from the meat. Concerning those chargers for vehicles, uh, this uh, company comes to my mind in Croatia, uh, Rimac. Yes. Uh, and they are uh, so advanced in, in many aspects. So I'm wondering, uh, is there not, not enough kind of chargers? or you are able to do something better than the chargers which are already existing, you can, you can top them with, with your creativity and your potential. You can improve some aspects, why, why you are uh, producing chargers, or it's, it's, it's cheaper to produce it here in Serbia than to buy a Croatian charger, for example. Well, I would say uh, everybody, you know, is searching for a niche, for a new possibility, uh, and you know, to add some innovation to the existing systems. Okay. So of course, we don't think that we can compete with big producers like Tesla or Renault. So, so that's not the goal. But they are thinking a different way. So okay. They are making a big, uh, um, like Tesla, they are covering. I don't know, a big part of the USA and they have their own system and they it's a part of their sales network and if you buy a Tesla car then you can charge at their charges. So it's a it's a business philosophy as well. So it's not only the, the hardware itself but it's also the business philosophy. So uh, when you put those two together then you have possibilities and to find uh, some market uh, niches where you have the possibility to even, you know, uh, develop a charger and sell it. So, uh, you, so you don't want to compete with Tesla, but there are other other channels where you can. Yes, yes. So since uh, uh, it's well known that uh, there is uh, a, a huge move towards electrical vehicles, and most of the countries have announced plans that they will only allow uh, electrical vehicles, let's say, in 2035 and on then you won't be able to buy new uh, fossil, uh, engines. fossil engine vehicles. Then everybody knows that they have 10 years to prepare. And even then I think the market will be so big and the demand will be big enough that everybody has a chance to make a good product and sell it. And with a little bit of innovation, a little bit of marketing, everybody has a chance on local markets and even on, on uh, wider regional. Yes, so I think you know, it's, it's mostly about the way, the vision, how you want to, uh, how you want to uh, uh, show your product, how you want to market your product and you know, find the niche. Someone can buy a more expensive product, you can make it to be cheaper and you will find your bias. On what, uh product or, or achievement are you the most proud? Well, I must say that we already have, uh, well, we are a young company, only 10 years, but we have very nice successes already and we have the opportunity to work with some big companies in Europe, and huge companies, and some of the nicest projects are related towards the multimedia field. Mm -hmm. uh, we were producing, or we are still working on a project which involves uh, mobile handheld audio guide systems. Sorry? Audio guide systems. It's handheld devices which uh, are like uh, museum guides or uh, uh -huh. things like that when you have an exhibition and you get a handheld device so it can you know, explain you about things, show you videos, uh, pictures, see. you can listen on many languages. Ah, I see, I see, I see. Yeah. So it, you bring it in your hand and it talks to you. On, you come to in the front of a picture and then it says exactly. the important things concerning that picture. And if it's necessary, it can project some video somewhere on a wall. You or can trigger something, yes, you get a video on a, on a projection or something. Hologram. Like so there are many use cases, many uh, interesting projects and this project or this device is um, uh, available you can use it in many of the European museums and we are proud that it came to big museums of big car manufacturers in Germany so I see most, I see most, uh, nicest projects I see I see very nice very nice 
I'm very happy that I come here, that I chose. I know that there are in some other places also the Explorers Night in Sovatica. That's true. Uh, but uh, <clears throat> I have never been here, so I said, okay, let's explore this place. Uh, thank you very much for, uh, for taking the time to tell us. <clears throat> I think it will be interesting to, to, for the people in uh, Serbia and also wider, because you are looking for both uh, place, I mean both, uh, or ev every, every client, ev anywhere, not only from Serbia, but from the whole world. And uh, because the internet is giving this opportunity of openness, uh, everyone towards everyone else, this information I hope that I can contribute to, to spread it on, on my little small YouTube channel and, uh, and uh, also for those people in Subotica youngsters who are looking opportunities in IT companies that we have such a, such a company, such three companies in a building which are developing so nicely, evolving, that's a rare thing to see that is not crushing down and sold by uh, Kopeikas and two other companies and it's uh, our creativity, our potential and uh, that it's so nicely developing, that's uh, very beautiful. Very beautiful result to see, to look at it. It's practically here, everyone can come, see the building, speak with the people. Very nice, that's very nice. Thank you. Well, it's, it's been uh, well, uh, a huge success for us as well. So we are very happy that we made it this far, but we still have a lot of visions, a lot of dream. We still have a lot of energy. So we are still looking to go on. And we have really great young people, talented people here in Subutica who are really interested in informatics. And uh, that's, that is what is giving us more uh, energy to go on. So we know that we have great people, we are able to provide great service, great products, and uh, we are looking towards widening our uh, services in the international market. Your, uh, in the company, in your company, the working hours are also fluent or you have uh, like fixed hours of work? We do have some uh, flexibility, so it's it's not uh, fixed that you have to come in at 8, eight, 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 to, four or eight to 4, so there is a flexibility, you can start a bit earlier, a bit later, but uh, yeah, we, we don't have, uh, you know, complete flexibility that you can work, at, for example, at night, so uh, well, we, we are more traditional in that sense. Sorry, you don't? More, more traditional in that sense with the working hours, so we have flexible work hours, but you, you can start between 7 and 9 typically, and then you can yeah, work. Yeah, I understand. Hours. And uh, we know that uh, the natural laws are also supporting the work during the day and less during the night, so it's more conducive for, for effective results for the brain and... Well, you know, it's also about the business because that's the, that's the business hours and when the clients are, you know, also available and when they want to interact. So, um, yeah. Okay. Uh, did you... Uh, did your company also went to some fun projects like... Uh, the upper company told me that they went to Bosnia on some rafting. Do you have kind of... A, this kind of special uh, treatment for the for your workers which are inspiring people to come to your company we do organize uh, team building events so i see team building. Uh, we had uh, international let's say excursions as well we went uh, to berlin once we went to vienna as a company and uh, also we often have uh, sport uh, events, okay. you know, we can come together and we have uh, football, we have uh, tennis, uh, ping pong, things like that. Uh, you, you visit uh, places, different places in Subotica for these events or you organize it here in the building? Well, there are various sports around Subotica and then we, depending on the sport, we go there. They are, then we make team building events when we just make a big party and it's also a team building event. I see, I see. So uh, it's important for the people to have this opportunity to be together outside of the work as well and you know, to cultivate the relationships and uh, 
to to make the you know the the, the feeling and, and the atmosphere better in the company. So your company is also uh, in the, the direction of that the friendliness between the people yes. that it's very important and it's not only a work related you you want to avoid that kind of only work related relationships you would like to support a kind of more familiar uh, feelings in between the, the workers and and uh, concerning uh, professional advancement do you have kind of uh, expose somewhere uh, where when where you go like uh, concerning professional development yeah so last year before finding more, more clients yes yeah. yes last year was a bit rough because of the corona and even these events got shut down and many of them were not held and many of them were in online form but it's simply not the same um, since we work with embedded devices and electronical parts and devices we visited a lot of electronic big expos and most of them are in Germany, we were even in some in Asia and there was a huge number of uh, people, a huge number of companies who make microchips, various solutions and it's always great to go to such big event, then you make connections, you find new possibilities, you find some new interesting products, you get an idea how to use it. So. Uh, we even met companies uh, from here, from Serbia, you know, you meet new people, so it's always a great experience. And um, yeah, it's unfortunately, since last year it, 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 it has stopped, but I hope that maybe from the next year on it will be again available. So they will open up? Yes, and they will again start to make these huge exports. So it's, it's uh, those, those are really great, and even the people you know, the young developers and engineers, they like to go there and to see that kind of uh, um, events. I guess uh, that in these three companies, the workers are not forced to vaccinate themselves. Just a well, it's still, uh, you know, it's a choice, a matter of a choice. I would say that most of them have been vaccinated. I see. Uh, so, uh, there is still no mandatory, you know, law okay. for it. So okay. It's okay. Still a choice. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. Thank you very much for for the time. Thank for you for the opportunity. Thank you. Those are all on desktop, boy. A to, to na čemu radite? A to je već vaša produkcija.
Vidim, HP, HP koristite? Uglavnom, mekovi, mekovi, par mekova. Imamo tri, četiri meka. To je više za iOS aplikacije. Aha. Ah, Linux machine. Systemi. Da, ok, sistemi Linux. Ale na ovej hape kvalitě musel přejít. Hm? Da, da, da. Pošle, to je neka vrsta softvera, razvoj nekog softvera. Da, njima smo radili to bukvalno sve od aplikacije i to samo tu je radna savržena i ostalo od ovom videu koji se može ostaviti na aplikaciju koja je nečajnih ovih učinja. I to je neki interpret, to ne znači da se ne ostaviti što ne samo kitbed koga svaki uvodni eksponat u kada koristi gdođe eksponat ukucije svaki svaki svoj ima svoj neki ID i onda na osnovu svakog ID može da se vidi njihove kompletne karakteristike video, stilici tekstone, sadržane, slike audio A da, to je kao muzej i ekspo, da no? Pa da, i vidi se meni istora koja je eksponata sve posjećena, da se ne vrati u kuglju muzeju ili nešto. Aha, aha. Vidi se, možda koji se vidi kao ovdje sam bilo, ovo je stavio se da ne mogu da odem, da ne sam sam možda sviđenje. Da, da, da. Da, da, naravno. Da, vi ti nešto što i ne razume i ne interesuje. Hvala lepo.
megnézzük a hasába. Az Event Horizon. 